I mean, holy sh**, Diablo. I wish you would ever play some shit in my life. Oh my god, dude. It's just not being able to stem that on that. I mean, how fast are you, dude? Like, holy sh**. Dummy is your Madden Bro, what champion. is up with these no, guys? Super bummer, dude. Oh. YouTube, this is probably my last video. I am going to Sao Paulo, Brazil for the opener in NFL, the Green Bay Packers and my Philadelphia Eagles. Uh, when this game was put on the schedule back in spring or whatever, my boy was like, let's go to Brazil. So we have buy, buy, bought our plane tickets in the spring, then a hotel in the summer, just bought my game tickets. Uh, probably about two weeks ago, I'm gonna sit in club seats in the club section. I will send all the stories, everything on Instagram. That link is below if you guys want to check out the time in Brazil stories and all that. So make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. But so I'll be off for a couple of days, not able to play Madden, but I did play some Mutt Champs. I did get a new team together, show you guys what I'm working with as far as my team is concerned and who I'm using here. Remember, hit that subscribe button. We're closing on 100,000 subscribers. Um, we did go the new team of the week. Team of the week is dope this year because they get a little boost for that week. So the new team of the week cards that come out will get a two point boost. So I dropped JJ McCarthy, who was a million coins still, and added Trevor Lawrence, who's obviously tall. He's fast, just about as fast as JJ McCarthy was. Uh, he has really good accuracy in that 90 throw power. So the team of the week is going to be relevant every single week. And what's cool about it is if you don't have a lot of these cards aren't that expensive. But if you don't, if you're no money spent or anything like that, you can get the team of the week from the week before. They're going to be cheaper because people will be dumping that week and getting the next one. And I really think team of the week has been an L in recent years, but this year it's gotten a lot better with that. Um, and we got this Velas Jones wide receiver. Team of the week is going to get even better when we have like players that aren't, you know, preseason players <laughs> going crazy. Uh, but Velas Jones, six foot tall, 89 speed. He's a monster. He's a dog. Uh, you know, we still got. That's the same old line we've been having. I picked JC Latham just because having a theme team uh, offensive lineman you can switch is really nice going forward for the rest of the year. He'll we'll be able to use him. Same thing with Jaden Daniels here, backup quarterback. The rookie premieres are good for that. Still got Heinz Ward. He's goaded. Still got Maserati Marv because we still have 20 Cardinals and 20 Washingtons, and we get the boost for for the team of the week. So that's super good. Frank Gore Jr. is kind of the running back this week, essentially, 87 speed. So he's not the worst. He's not the worst player. Can he spin good? Not really, but they nerf spins anyway, as I talked about in the patch video. But, um, yeah, that's, I mean, still the Duke is still the best tight end. He's just so fast with that Washington theme team. Defense, what we're going to do now is we're going to get this Tony Jefferson card, 90 overall with the boost, 90 speed because he has Cardinals and the team of the week boost 90 speed what i'm doing with him put him at linebacker and blitz him in free safety zone blitz out a dollar try to get him through the a gap still got ken houston and paul kraus i want to tell you guys i have abandoned all knockouts don't think they're good i went with pick artists on paul kraus pick artists on darius slay and that double or nothing on mean joe green for one ap those are my defensive abilities i still have Derek stingley he is a mill but I think he's probably still like a top four corner in the game with 87 speed. I'm probably going to sell him pretty soon here, especially going to Brazil for a couple of days. Try to get, and then get somebody else when I get back on Monday. But yeah, that's, that's what I got right now. This Nick Herbert card, call me crazy, but this card is a monster. Uh, he's going to replace Lawrence Taylor, 88 speed, 90 power move. Dude, he's going to play defensive end for me. We'll see how he goes. Uh, but yeah, he's a monster. Love that card. Bobby Wagner, Justin... This is weird, a weird name for me. I feel like he's missing a vowel in his name. Justin Shrinan? Shrin? I don't know, boys. Shout out to the Broncos. Not going to use this guy, but he looks pretty good. 6'3", he's 87 speed. Uh, not not the worst card at all. Uh, we did get rid of Chance Campbell, the guy we were using for a week, and we used him in the tournament. Uh, and then I have Jeremy Chin, who's not in the lineup to count as Kem, but he is Washington Kem. We're going to use her him 6'7". I mean, or it's not 6'7", 6'3", 87 speed. So he's just as fast as uh, that linebacker, just tall, but maybe he moves better as a safety. As you come down here, 82 change of direction. He has a little bit better zone coverage. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do. That's my team. I'm rocking Mel Blunt and Stingley in the slots. Still have Max Crosby right here. I don't know when he's going to be outdated, but... Not yet. That's how I feel, kind of. He's kind of still a beast for me, Max Crosby, 85 speed. But I am rocking the Jets defense and the Colts playbook that's on Madden Surf, the ebook. So uh, let me, that's it, boys. I'm watching some gameplay, playing a little Mutt Champs. 
like I said, boys, I'm going away for a couple of days. Brazil, make sure you guys tune in. Give me an NFL team that's guaranteed to win this weekend. That's what I want to know. Who's your NFL team, and who do you think is guaranteed to win this weekend? For me, it's the Eagles. Dude, I don't know why the Packers are getting so much love. What are they better at than the Eagles? Anywhere. That's all I got for you, boys. But like I said, I appreciate you guys subscribing. We will hit 100,000 subscribers this year in Madden. We have to manifest it. We have to believe. Like I said, enjoy the weekend. First NFL Sunday. Hope you guys' fantasy teams are lit. Hope you guys enjoy. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Please hit the like button, boys. We'll be back in a couple days. 76 hit power. Oh, He's not bad. I wish he got every team chem like the first season season cards. They really said, nah, we made our free cards too good. No huddle. It's LG, bro. I want to go to Brazil now. I should be in Brazil right now, bro. I, I didn't think I needed to click on that on fourth and fucking 20, dude. I really was like, yo, I don't need to click on this. It's fourth and 20. You just lob it in there. Nah, Madden dies for like two weeks right now. Did I ask? Madden dies. It's the pressing time of Madden. Cause everybody plays 2K and like 2K gets a little bit of noise for a little bit. People are kind of like over the initial push of Madden, but then once like, once like October comes, September always kind of shitty Madden month really. Okay. Are you got time to actually do that? Good play. Stingley. I hate this fucking game, dude. I really do. Like, how is this even an option for you to throw? Uh, what team that is guaranteed going to lose this weekend, boys? Give me a team that is guaranteed, dude. Guaranteed to lose this weekend. Who you guys got?
I mean, like, oh my god, where the fuck are you? Like, why are you just not guarded? Like, oh my god, this shit is just potato fucking love right now, dude. I mean, holy shit, Diablo. I wish you would ever play some shit in my life. Oh my god, dude. It's just not being able to stem that on that. I mean, how fast are you, dude? Like, holy shit. I don't think I'm ever playing Mud Champs again. I think this is so dead for me. This shit is just, like, too miserable to first, like, 18 games of this shit. Run up my ass, you know. Here we go. God, just missed the spin move so bad, man. Y'all motherfuckers do shit for rewards way too much, bro. Like that shit is actually like an epidemic, bro. Motherfuckers was just—I swear to God, they just robbed their mother for weekend league rewards, bro. So I gotta sit here and play this fucking idiot. I mean, the point with CJ is he's the fastest dude out there. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. I'm losing my mind. Like, my mind is just like... I mean, Slay, what the fuck are you doing, dude? You're never gonna throw off, dude. Touchdown. I mean, dog. Oh my god, I fucking hate this shit ass play, dude. Let's go, Mean Joe. Hit his ass. Man, y'all say it's easy to go bald until you go going bald, and it's like, oh shit, I need to go bald. So it's not that easy to cut your fucking hair off, dude. I don't know why he runs that play ever. Like, that shit hasn't worked all fucking game, dude. Yo, the high balls is so fucking ass, bro. 
The high ball is so trash. Oh, zone, zone. I don't know how y'all be getting banned and you know what I'm saying? Bro, they just don't want to stay in the end zone, bro. Uh -huh. You got it. Clamp GG's, bro.